so this is a uh, Moto 2 of the Team of the Amateurs. I, uh, I always try to just jump the gate if I can, <clears throat> then I just stick back. I've had really, really bad starts this year, so uh, yeah, this is kind of the approach I've been taking, because it's just so hectic in AMS. Uh, so, I don't know, like, I've had one top, I think it was top four out of the gate, or like uh, out of the first corner, so that was sweet. I ended up seventh in that moto, but anyways, so we are now seven minutes in, I'm in 25th, I was, I was in 26th, uh, so I rode like complete garbage at the start of this, and uh, this, this right here, <laughs> as shitty as it was, it was the turning point. I, I don't know if I was just pissed off, and then I do this little tweak turn around there. And, uh, yeah, so, I'm back on the, uh, back on the consistent wagon. Not, not too fast, but <laughs> you can see my quickest lap was 243. Pretty bad. So, yeah, right here, I'm finally doing good again. Uh, hitting the top 20. I had already, uh, I was uh, in call with Brandon during the race. He was spotting for me, and we have <laughs> we have this deal going. If we don't get any points, we're we're done racing. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, when I was in 26, and it was halfway through. Even at this point, I was 13 minutes in, and I'm in 19. And I, I'm always aiming for a top 10. So. I wasn't I wasn't too happy with myself. Uh, it was it was mostly my issue. It wasn't other people. But uh, yeah, anyways. So this this I I start turning it around. I'm running like the 220 mid range, 223, 222s. Um, I'm definitely not a fast rider, but I can usually pull off some consistency here and there. So yeah, you can see like there was just a train of riders. Uh, from like the top 20 all the way up and I think I get into 14th here so yeah that was it was a pretty quick turnaround and uh, w once you kind of gain those few spots it could definitely gives you some motivation and uh, by that point we can see we're at 15 minutes now I screw this up and get passed back <laughs> but then I just fucking rail into the inside and pass them back good battles <laughs> And then, uh, yeah, there, unfortunately there's a lot of just people going down in your pass, there's not too many, like, straight up passes, but right here, I think this guy straight up pass, I, yeah, I trail along behind for a bit, I decide to go inside line, hope he screws up outside, but he doesn't, um, yeah, good old <laughs> scrubbing super sideways. Everyone was going really right up this uphill. I didn't realize that till after the races. Uh, I guess it's better because you're not bouncing around. Yeah, this is where I get the pass. I was always like coming into it in fourth and then downshift off the top, holding second till the bottom here, back into first. And then well, I kind of fucked that up. So he catches me in the corner, but then I, <laughs> I'm able to hold the line. Yeah, that was, that was fun being able to outdrive someone down the hill. Here is where I get into ninth finally. Um, I I don't know where the guy was, but uh, I think he went off the track. So yeah, my my first moto I got ninth, and my second moto I I wanted to at least match it, and somehow I went from 26th halfway through to up to ninth. So. I was pretty happy. Even on the stream, they said I looked pretty happy with a ninth. It's not. It's not the ninth that I'm happy about. It's that I went from like really far back up to ninth. So that was, yeah, that was a not a bad race, except for the first half that was garbage. So, so then I think I run through the top ten here. Um, I think Ashton is the rookie, and they talked about him a whole bunch, and then, you know, let's run through the top ten. There you go. That's how you charge from last, almost, to top ten.